So you went to America for your exchange year? How was it? Right after when I came back from my exchange year that I had during my high school, my friends came up to me and asked this with excitement. But I was not sure what to say besides I'd made lots of friends, I learned to speak English, and I gained some weight, maybe a lot. <laughs> when I was 15, I chose to go to the United States, and I happened to be in a small town in Iowa, surrounded by cornfields. The views that I saw in the first couple of the days were far from what I expected to see in America. No tall buildings, but a very wide sky and cornfields. Not many burger shops, but a tiny cinema with about 20 seats. No Asian nor black students, but only white students in high school. After spending a couple of months there, I found that not only was the town different from my home, Tokyo, but also it was different from the image that I had of America. I began to feel lonely, insecure, and vulnerable. What made me feel more insecure was that there was not much to do. When I was in Tokyo, I was always occupied with so much to do, like schoolwork, going to cafes with friends, and going to beaches with family on weekends. But in Iowa, I did not have that much schoolwork. There was nowhere to go on weekends. And my host family did not like going outside activities on weekends, but instead watched YouTube or movies at home. There, throughout the year, I struggled to try to figure out how to spend my time. The pressure that the exchange year need to do, needed to be fun and perfect made me struggle more. But there was nothing to do. So I tried to talk to more people, join more clubs, and join a new communities in the town. I immersed myself in being involved in club activities. I ended up joining 12 clubs in high school. I'm gonna number this. Basketball, tennis, cross country, business club, jazz band, concert band, marching band, show band, choir, volunteering, drama, and speech. There we go. <laughs> Almost all the clubs that my high school had. At that time, I was just doing my best. After coming back from Iowa, I had a couple of chances to talk to people about how my exchange year was. I was not sure how I changed. But as old exchange students who went to America would say, I also told people I became more outgoing. However, it was really a month ago when I was talking with my friends that we've known each other for more than 16 years that I noticed how my time and struggle in Iowa made me grow up so much. She told me that she felt that I changed a lot throughout the exchange year, from the one being blended in the group of people to the one who is outstanding in the group and actively expressing opinions. At this moment, I finally felt how meaningful my year in the middle of the cornfield was. I really changed. I was a shy, not challenging, and a passive girl. But I changed to be a more independent, responsible, active, challenging, and fearless person. And here I am. Here I am voluntarily talking in front of people. When I was in Iowa, I sometimes had the fear that I was wasting my time in such a monotonous countryside. But now I can say with confidence that this little town in the middle of the cornfield has made my life so much more interesting. <laughs>